little fox. Fun at Kids Central. Earth Day Butterfly Garden. Nina hurried into Kids Central. Guess what? She said. My class went to the butterfly garden for Earth Day. Now I know everything about butterflies. Bugs are boring, Bobby said. Nina glared at him. Butterflies are important. Bobby shrugged. Oh, boring. <laughs> Hi, everyone, a voice said. Cool, Mr. Dunn's here again, Jason said. Miss Shelley's out today, Mr. Dunn said. So I'm here to celebrate Earth Day with everybody at Kids Central. In science, we talked about recycling. Izzy said. We made birdhouses, Jason said. Well, we're going to plant a butterfly garden, Mr. Dunn said. Nina grinned. I know a lot about butterflies. They pollinate flowers. Mr. Dunn smiled. They also keep plants healthy. Let's go outside. Ms. Falani said we can put the garden near the playground. The kids filled their water bottles and walked outside. I already prepared the soil for our garden, Mr. Dunn said. He pointed to a sunny spot. Let's make a border with some rocks. After they finished making the border, Mr. Dunn showed the kids a drawing. This shows where to plant things. Ethan picked up a plant. What's this? Milkweed, Mr. Dunn said. I know about that, Nina said. Some caterpillars eat milkweed before they turn into butterflies. Jason looked at the drawing. The milkweed goes over there, he said. I'll help Ethan plant it. Izzy and Nina looked at other flowers. They're very colorful, Izzy said. Butterflies see more colors than people do, Nina said. They even see ultraviolet light that is invisible to us. Let's plant these yellow flowers first, Izzy said. These were a good choice, Mr. Dunn, Nina said. The flowers are flat, so the butterflies can reach the nectar. Mr. Dunn lifted his eyebrows. I'm glad you approve. Bobby looked at two circles on the drawing. Are those landing pads for butterflies? Mr. Dunn laughed. <laughs> nope, they're rocks. Butterflies rest on flat rocks, Nina said. The rocks give off heat in the morning. That helps the butterflies warm up. I learned... We know, Bobby said. You learned everything at the butterfly garden. He put the two flat rocks in place while the others planted flowers. Then Mr. Dunn gave Bobby a shallow bowl and a bucket of sand. This is for our butterfly puddler. Mr. Dunn explained how the butterfly puddler worked. Bobby filled the bowl with sand. Then he poured in water until it reached the top of the sand. Soon the planting was done. Ethan watered the garden. Then the kids sat under a tree sipping water. Now we wait for a butterfly, Mr. Dunn said. I see one, Nina cried. It's going to our garden. Awesome, Bobby said. It's drinking from the butterfly puddler. Huh? Nina said. What's a butterfly puddler? Bobby smiled. It's like a bird bath for butterflies. They can stand on sand while they drink water. Oh, Nina flushed. That's cool. I guess I don't know everything about butterflies.
little box.